Good morning, my lovely Pisces. How are you doing on this lovely morning? All right, it looks muggy out and it's look like it's going to rain again. But I want to say thank you, Lord, for waking us up. And if you're watching me, that means he woke you up too. So thank you, God, for that. Pisces, um, thank you for all those who like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for all those who donate and get private readings. And thank you for all those who go to my webpage and purchase my items, such, such as my Black Magic Spell Breaker Candle. Remember I told y'all I put that candle out there to burn. So this is the new one that I put up. This is the Love Yourself, I mean, the Abundant Prosperity, Healing, Growth, Wealth, and Fertility candle. This is the Love Yourself candle, and everybody knows that I burned the Justice candle. Always burning on this altar. These are my candles, all the other candles. You go on my webpage, you can get the one you want. This is the Sage with the Palo Santo. This is the, um... The walnut bath that we all need, we all should take. This is my oils to come and dry for them. You can put them in anything you want. My jewelry, which I will be making my bracelet today. Today is the day, honey. Um, my crystals, okay, and my stones. There's a stone for every part of your body and a crystal. Get with it. This right here is my um, red dust, okay, red red brick dust. This is mine, and the reason why it's like that because I'll be selling out on it a lot. This is the spiritual detox bath, right? It is not, it is not Epsom salt, it's cave salt, and I also have herb in the bag. Um... So if you don't have a tub, you can still use the um take a bath with the herb in the bag. All right, Pisces. I hope today is a better day for each and every one of us. We are awake, we are alive. So that right there should be more than enough. Let's get going with the reading. I woke up early so that I can get this reading out there for those who like to watch me just before you go to work. All the kids are back to school. I get pictures of the kids dressed, ready to go on that bus or to school. Um, you know, I do have my little Pisces, uh, little family here. Um, and um, I do have this little girl that watches me. I told her mom that she can come on my YouTube. So I have to go look for her again. All right. So Pisces. Your kids look wonderful. Like I said, start buying your kids Christmas stuff. Buy them one at a time. All right, you got time now, so you don't have to feel like you're overwhelmed. Do your Christmas shopping now. For those who buy a Christmas gift. Okay? All right, here we go. Join the Art and Art Michael, I am about to give your, help me do this reading, and I am putting Ambrose Non-Slippery for your cards. A shout out to my Witches Tarot sister Jennifer and to Nicole. Nicole People are calling me for your information. I'll send it to them. All right? All right. Spirit Archangel, guide me to do this reading. Let me see what you got to say. Tell me. Tell me, Spirits. Tell me what you got to tell my lovely Pisces. All right? Tell me what you got to tell my lovely Pisces. The first card you got is the Ten of Cups. You already start with a good card. The Ten of Cups, someone's coming to you. Someone, uh, it usually shows the happy family, but this guy's on his knees. 
proposing to you, Pisces, proposing to you. Let's see the way the face look on the reading. You got them uh, yellow lilies uh, and a white one that you blow. This lady looks serious. She doesn't look like she's playing or smiling. And this man is on his knees, took his hat off. Looks like he is a real gentleman. The Ten of Cup is that family that let's have it all together. All right, have it all together. On You don't even see men these days propose to a woman like that. Uh, these days, I don't know what they call propose. They come with a ring and say, okay, let's get married. You know? But, all right, this person looks like he want to take a leap of faith, but this person don't have too much to offer you. He's letting you know I'm coming with damn near nothing to offer you. All right, so somebody here is coming with damn near nothing, okay? Um, they want to take a leap of faith, but don't have too much to offer. The five of cup, this person, maybe this person um, wanted to meet you. You thought this person was the one. He didn't have anything to come to the table with. Too much of nothing. And the five of cups, it feels like you may feel like you uh, missed out on an opportunity with a person or you felt like this person is coming with close to nothing. And as soon as it started, it was over. And um, now you're sitting there, the dog is looking at the man. Or whoever this is, you looking up front. you just sitting there looking like you're in a daze, holding your hand. With a French bulldog, an English bulldog, some kind of dog. Uh, um what you call them, um, um, but looking at the man, okay, looking at the man, now the dog noticed the man, but you, but you haven't, so somebody still wants to come around with this opportunity, but Pisces, you're not even acknowledging the person, you're not acknowledging the person, because maybe you think of everything that they didn't have to offer you. Or you feel like, I can do bad by my damn self. I can do good by myself. All right? But there's somebody here that wanted to give you the Ten of Cups, but this person don't look like they have too much to offer you. But the Ten of Cups is like everything you wanted, but this person has nothing to really offer you. This may look like one of those people that come over and do, and really don't have anything for you, live off of you, and you do everything for them, but you feel like, oh, well, I guess that was an opportunity miss. And then you sit there and you think about everything you ever been to that went through with a person that didn't make you feel good, okay? That's the way it be sometimes, Pisces. Sometimes you think you got it all, but somebody, and not that they coming with nothing to offer you, they probably are not giving you what you want or whatever it is. The loss, disappointment, or regrets. It can be a challenge when facing loss. Mourning as much as you can. Okay, it's like you're going through this mourning part. Sometimes you will um, miss an opportunity if you don't look at what you have in order to feel better. Um, turn around and see what's left behind rather they What's left behind them focusing on the problem. So you're focusing on the problem here, and you feel like you're missing out on opportunity, but you're not looking back. 
Because you're not. It's like you're not. you focusing on everything that went wrong. Rather than to focus on, um, you know, what you have, what you still have, what you can have. Somebody here wants to offer you everything, love, family, everything, but you feel like this person feel like they can't take a leap of faith because they really don't have too much to offer you. Then you feel like you're missing out on opportunity because you're focusing on everything that is going not well rather than what is going well in your life. What what did what was good in this relationship? All right. What was it? Like, you're dealing with somebody that you thought that you love and love you, but this person's coming like, I ain't got nothing for you. And then you feel like, oh, shit, well, I guess I missed out on opportunity. And you may feel bored and frustrated, but be blessed for everything you do have and count on the blessings rather than what you missed out on because Pisces... You can do bad by yourself and good by your damn self. You don't have to sit there and keep worrying about. Sometimes just a person can have everything, but they don't give you nothing. Okay? You could have been with a person that has everything, but it wasn't for you. Because they didn't want to give it to you. So why would I take a leap of faith? It's like somebody think it's like you feel like somebody loves you, but they come in. Like, not with too much for you, all right? But then once you walk away, you feel like, oh, my God, did I miss out on the opportunity? Because this person is not acting right or coming right with you. So you, you sit there, you focus, and you talk about all the negative shit that you've been through. But remember of all the good things that you have. Or what place you're really in and in your life. For the Ten of Cups, you get the Nine of Cups. That means this person might have gave you or you felt like it was the one that would complete your life. But then the Nine of Cups means you get back in the shape. You're going to the gym. You um, uh, working on yourself. Okay. And you're looking at yourself or taking selfies or whatever of how you look. You feel good about yourself. This is a, um, when you are... Like Christmas in um, August. It's like you have everything you want. You're looking at yourself. You're taking care of yourself. You know, you, you, this person made an offer you the Ten of Cups is everything. But now you're looking at it like this person is feeling like you around Christmas time. This person finds you very, very sexy. Tell me more about the fool. Tell me more about the fool. Tell me more about the fool. The fool, the two of cups. What the fool is like, if this person may be from a different country, but the two of cups is that having and all that marriage, like that union. This person, or you may feel like this person is not doing everything for you. Um, but you, but they want to take a leap of faith, but they don't know until they get there. Like, I don't have nothing to offer the Pisces, but, um, but I do love Pisces or, um, Pisces may feel, I need to take a leap of faith, but it shows a man here wanting to take a leap of faith, but they feel like I just got love. I ain't got nothing else to give your ass. What the fuck? You tied up at the ankle. So that means that. I don't know if you married to this person. I don't know if this person wants to take it to another level. But this person um, doesn't, you know, they want to take a leap of faith. But I don't see this person doing much but showing you love. They ain't got nothing else for you. All right. What is the five of cups? What is the five of cups? It's a lot of emotional a feelings, it's a lot with your emotions here, how you feel, how you feel, what is the five of cups, what is the five of cups, 
What is the Five of Cups? This is about a love. This ain't about somebody taking care of you. Um, the Five of Cups. Feeling like you, like I said, like you missed out on opportunity. With this person with a devil energy. Like, this, like you have a connection with this person that you feel like you cannot break free from. Like, I don't know what kind of connection it is, but it's a connection where you can't see, it, it, no matter what, it's like, we got love and that's all we got. We ain't got nothing else but love, but a sex thing. Um, like, depending on a person, but I mean, a, a, a emotional. Like, that, I'm sorry, but I'm going to say this. You know what this reminds me of? Of like a dog. You know how they give you that emotional support dog that you carry anywhere you want? Like, you can take this dog anywhere you want with an emotional um, certificate or ID or whatever, right? This is what this person reminds me of. Emotionally, they there. Having sex, they there. Whatever. take For you to take care of them, they there. But emotionally, that's all it is. It's a connection that is emo it's an emotional connection. It ain't nothing else there but emotional. Like they wanna be there to comfort you and this, but they ain't got nothing else for your ass. Shit. And this is all love. So I don't know if you was deal if you're dealing with a, a person, Gemini Libra, I mean Pisces Scorpio Cancer, but this man really is showing that they have nothing to offer you but comfort. Ain't that a bitch? So, in other words, if I tell you this, if anybody, they got comfort for themselves in your life. They want to be comfortable with you, all right? But they really don't have too much of anything for you. Now, you might, have not, you might not be with this person, but you feel like you're missing out on opportunity. But of what? what? It's, like, it's like somebody that you can have fun with, but they're not there for nothing else. And everything is cups, so yeah, all these cups. Tell me what is the nine of cups? The nine of cups with the three of wands. Noble growth. Like you running. It's like somebody is really losing weight, exercising, trying to get their body right. Okay. Like, it's like somebody's really going, I guess, I don't know, but somebody is really taking care of themselves, okay? Really, really taking care of themselves as far as their health, all that. Because it's like you're running, right? Now, it is empower, moving a boy, freedom, freedom. It shows like you made it somewhere, like you have made it to where you want to be. Look ahead, even if you are practically satisfied with where you are, you still need to start making plans on where you want to go next. Consider many approaches to you, problems or goals, and take advantage of the situation um, you have. Or it's like you're there. You see the picture, you, you feel like it's there, right? It's in the horizon. But whatever problems you have, get help, right? It's always help out there. You're trying to make it somewhere. You It's like you you losing weight and you keep telling yourself, I'm going to lose weight. I'm gonna, And you're doing it little by little. But I just feel like Pisces, this love that you got, and, it, and it's the Ten of Pentacles, like, you really, with all of this is going on, you really trying to keep in shape. You're trying to keep yourself together, all right? Tell me more about this Two of Cups. Oh, Lord. So, the Two of Cups and the King of Cups are peaceful, de peaceful diplomatic, diplomatic. With the Two of Cups... I don't know. I just feel like somebody is not offering you anything, but it's love here. I don't know if you was married to this person or you are close to this person. And like, you can't let go of this person. 
I feel like somebody probably met somebody that's, that you want to feel like you can marry. This person look good. Take care of themselves. But you want to take a leap of faith on this new union. And you you may be the king of cups. You may be the Pisces. Maybe dealing with another uh, a sign of your own. But the King of Cups is saying that um, the King of Cups is sitting here looking clean as fuck with that wine glass. I don't know. It's like you're taking a leap of faith on, I don't know if this is a new connection. Okay. But it looks like you're taking a leap of faith here. Like you went through something. And maybe you're meeting somebody new and you're going for it. Right? Now, the King of Cups, um, wise, affectionate, all right, um, there to guide you and protect you and tell you, you know, everything's going to be okay. He goes after his passion. He is kind, compassion, and full of um, wisdom. He may lack the drive of pursuing um, the material wealth. Okay, he may lack on pursuing the material wealth. Like he may say that he don't have too much to offer you. As he is more focused on non-material parts of life, he is a creator and a good listener. He can be an inspirational and make you feel calm. So he's here to, he might not have nothing to offer you, but he loves you and he wants to marry you, but but he can, it's like he don't live in a material world at all. He really don't, but he got a lot more to offer you. The love and that connection. What is this devil? The Queen of Wands and the Devil, Capricorn, Tars, and Virgo. Um, you're confident and you bold. You like the Beyonce on this relationship. You really thinking with the Five of Cups, like, did I miss out on opportunity? Because it's like you really stuck on somebody here, and I'm not lying. I don't know. It, it, I don't know. Like this person. Loves like you, you, y'all very attracted to each other, but Pisces, you the one that got it going on. This person don't really have shit to offer you. You may be dealing with a Capricorn, a Capricorn, a Scorpio, a Cancer, a Pisces. Um, you got a lot, a lot, a lot of water sign feelings, emotions. When I tell you, you got a lot of water sign, a lot of water sign. So this is all about how you feel. And the, only, the two major cards you got, excuse me, taking a leap of faith and the devil. They are the major arcanas. But there is a couple, the king of cup and the uh, one. So this person may not be into the material things, but Pisces, you about creativity. You about getting what you want. You about moving on and, you know, doing stuff, you know. And this person is all about love and making you feel like you're secure with them. But they're not the materialistic people. They, um, you know, they work hard for whatever they have. They, it's nothing given to them. Nothing comes easy to them. Um, but then um, just remember who you're dealing with. They can also be lazy as hell and think that having sex and having fun is everything. It's more than that. They might feel like they can be your angel and guide you and listen to you, but that's all they got for you. You know, while you're doing everything else. So, Pisces, I don't know what to tell you about this. All right? It looked like you want something, but whoever you want. It's like us, I don't know, it's like you connected to this person. Um, you may be in love with somebody, but this person ain't really 
you putting a lot of, you're going to be the one putting the work into this. Tell me more. A power couple. You two are about to take over the world. There's so much greater work to be done and a story to create with this person. You, you both are breaking generational cycles. So this might be somebody new that you're meeting. Like you just start to meet this person or this person just came into your life. All right. Wedding. This situation involves marriage. They may be an upcoming wedding, you, your own or someone else's. This car also um, says that you're a uh, signified validation that you will get married. Somebody's offering you marriage, honey. Somebody's telling you you are their partner. The pursuer. To pursue love means to act with your with intentions and uh, pursuit. Approaching the uh, approaching with um, generosity acts of those that we deserve and that deserve us. So y'all meeting somebody that. That's gonna love y'all, but and they want they talk about marriage and all of this. They want to pursue the marriage, and this is the couple. This is like you feel like this is the one proposal, honey. Somebody here wants to propose to you. There is a desire to take this connection to the next level. Are you ready? Somebody here is you feel like this person is the one for you. But it's uh, it's like this person can be very addictive to you. Make sure and addictive means that you can't help it. You really like this person, right? Uh, you might be under a change in lock with this person. Like, I don't know. But it did say you went from walking away into... Somebody here wanting to have it all with you. Now, this person, look at this. The father wants, I'm telling you, somebody wants to marry you. It's married in somebody's life. Somebody wants to propose to you. And it might be a Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer, Capricorn, or it could be um, the fool is an Aries. It might be an Aries. It might be a Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer, or it may be um, a Capricorn. One thing I didn't see, no Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So that's a good thing because you're not in your head over this. All right? You're not like all like you was before. So that's a good thing. That's a blessing when you're not all in your head. All right? Pisces, if you need a reading, get it from me or someone else. This reading was good. It was good. But somebody wants to move and promise you the world. And you feel like you got a deep, deep connection. Or you feel like you are connected on a level like you never had before. All right? Thank you and have a blessed day. I'll see you soon. Bye. If you need a reading, get it from me or someone else because I don't hate on nobody's parade. Get it from whoever you want to get it from, okay? This is a general reading, not a private reading. Bye.